Ever since it came out for the 2017 model year, the second-generation Honda Ridgeline has been one of our favorite mid-size trucks. The Ridgeline moves better than many of its competitors because it is built on a platform that was originally made for cars instead of trucks. The Ride Glide isn't as good off-road, but trims like the Trail Sport make it good for all kinds of terrain. It's just that the Ridgeline is old. Every other mid-size truck that has come out since it has been completely rebuilt or is brand new. Due to the fact that Honda's only pickup, the Ridgeline, might be getting a complete makeover for 2025-5, the company can't let the younger bucks steal the show. Possible change. It's based on the three-row Honda Pilot SUV, more especially the Pilot from the last generation. The big crossover was redesigned in 2023, and the Passport, which has two rows of seats, will be rebuilt for 2025. It would make more sense to remake the 2025 Ridgeline with all the newest features than to keep it as the only vehicle that uses the old platform. If Honda does release a new Ridgeline, it will likely have a stronger exterior, a more up-to-date navigation system, and an interior that looks like Honda's newest products. The only thing that probably won't change is the 3.5-liter V6 engine. The Pilot pretty much used the same engine from one generation to the next, and it's likely that the Ridgeline will do the same. Competitors to think about. For years, the Ridgeline was our pick for the best mid-sized truck, until the new Chevrolet Colorado came out in 2023. It's a big step up from the old Colorado, and gearheads will love that there are three off-road focused trims to pick from. The newly refreshed Jeep Gladiator, the new for 2024 Ford Ranger, and the Toyota Tacoma are some other pickups that are right behind the Ridgeline. What we believe. The Ridgeline is still a good choice in its class, but a new look could help it take back the mid-size truck crown from the Chevy Colorado.